YouTube. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. I have watermelon. <laughs> Contagin. This is so good. Oh my gosh. <clears throat> Welcome back to my YouTube channel. And if you're new here, you will. Wait, what? I got another one of the Sandia made me throw. Hola YouTube, welcome back to my YouTube channel and if you're new here, welcome to the crazy family and if you've already been here, if you know that you're part of the family, that means you already know you're part of that family, honey. <laughs> okay, so we're back again with another tutorial. I'm kind of excited. I just I just want to beat my face and put makeup on and um, this is going to be me sometimes. This is the reality. Like when I put makeup on, I have my, my towel on my head because I wash my hair like three times a week because I sweat a lot when I work out. So um, yeah, this is how I get ready. My back rope and my towel on my head and then I transform it. I'm like, yes, yes, yes. But for right now, this is how we really look like. This is reality of the situation. Um, anyways, um, starting off with uh, MAC Prep and Prime Natural Radiance. One of my favorite primers for a long time. Uh, we use like four little click, 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 click. Put it all over the face. All right, natural radiance on point. Um, I'm gonna be using the new for Sally. So skin tune. <laughs> I received this on a PR package. I feel like an instrument girl. Instagram. Instagram girl about to drop this on the face. Uh, this is the new skin tune blur perfecting stick. Yeah, it's basically gonna blur. I'm gonna apply this. Well, this one. It smells good. I'm gonna apply this in the areas where I normally have like my pores and stuff like that. In the T-zone of my face, basically. I'm trying to be Instagram girl. I'm not enough for that. Why is that grabbing none? I'm not applying too much. Okay, I'll put, I think I put too much. Okay. Oh, I like how it dry in the skin. It's not skin tone. It's not going to make you look like nothing, but it feels good in the skin. I'm not going to lie. All right, so now we're going to go in with my regular, the everyday, the normal. You guys already know, Studio Feels Conceal Correct. This right here is my best prime for life. I'm going to use the orange side. I never use this side. What is this side for? If any of you guys know, comment below and let me know because I don't have no idea. I'm going to put this all over my face. All right, we look like an Oompa Loompa, and that's what we try to go for. That's the goal here. Um, now I'm gonna move on to foundation. I'm gonna use one of my old favorites. Let me shake her before. I'm gonna be using one of my old favorites. Um, I haven't touched her in a while, so I'm kinda excited to touch her today. Sounds disgusting, that sounds kinda nasty, but do you know what I mean? <laughs> I'm gonna be using the natural, the NARS Natural Radiance Foundation. Um, this used to be my favorite. I just, you know, jump from one thing to another. Anyways, yesterday I washed all my brushes. Am I the only one that feels like a brand new woman when you brush your, when you wash your brushes and like when you fold clothes and wash clothes? I feel like that every time I do that. Like I'm an adult. Like wow. Oh man, I'm an adult. Talking about uh, speaking about adults. Dios mío. I have. Am I that? Don't be. Don't judge me for this, but. Am I the only one that lets like the light in the water bill just pass? Like I haven't paid my light in water bill for like five months. And the bill came today to $689. And I was like, oh crap. And I tried to call today to pay it. And they were closed already. So I have to wait for Monday. Like Monday I'm about to do so many adult stuff. Like wow, I'm about to turn 30. And it's like, I'm adulting. Is the weird, like, I don't want to be an adult. I hate being an adult. And I also, I'm telling all you guys all my problems. We're friends, so I think we're good. Anyway, this, uh, before I'm wrong with my story, this uh, sponge is by LC. LSC. I'll put it down below. Um, one of my favorite booty blenders. And it's literally a booty blender. But plug. Um, yeah, like, am I the only one that just don't take care of the bills on time? And I have so many delays. What else I owe? I owe, I owe so much stuff. Like in total is like, like $4,000. <laughs> I'm exaggerating, probably like 3,000 something. And I have to pay all that on one day. And I'm like, great, you said, great, great, great. Thank God I have money saved because if I didn't, I would be kicked out of my apartment. No, I never been late parent. Never. Ne so that's something that I have never, even when I was like broke, um, I always had enough money to pay my rent. But I didn't have enough money for food or nothing like that. But 
and not everything I did. But yeah, the bills came in today. Well, the thing is, the bills been on my box of the mail, but I just don't open it, and I don't, I don't want to deal with it. It's like I'm running away from it because I want my mom to take care of it, but I don't live with my mom. I live by myself. And um, today I was like, it is said it's time to grow up, go open that thing and see the bills. And when I saw the water and the light bill, I was like, six hundred and something dollars. But it's like a four, like a five. What is it? Mm, is it? I think it's like three months, three months, four months worth of that. And I do. I sleep with the air conditioner every day and all that stuff. Oh, I forgot how much I love this foundation. Oh, I love this foundation so much. I forgot how much I love there. Now we're gonna move on to concealers. I'm gonna be grabbing the Revolution Concealer and Define. These two right here. I've been having this ones on my makeup drawer for the longest time, but I forgot that I had them. So today when I was speaking about makeup to do, I was like, you know what, let's give this one a try. I haven't given them a try. So the color I'm in, I'm in C13. This one right here is the darker one. This is gonna be for conceal. And the C12 to highlight. So let's start with the C13. That look really good. Wow. You guys saw how I put the inside of my nose? Because sometimes in here I don't paint it and it looks different color. Don't judge me. Ooh, that looks good. I'm like, okay, excuse me, revolution, whatever you are, whatever you are. Um, now we're gonna go ahead. Did I write a contour thingy? Um, I'm gonna be using the Anastasia Beverly Heels. Uh, what is this contour kit in cream? This right here, I've been using that. I love using this one to add a little bit of lighter underneath my eyes to make it more pop without adding any more products to make it look cakey. So that's like my new thing to do when I want it snatch face. And normally I use my stick, but I don't have it here and I don't feel like it up. So I'm gonna go ahead and use one of these dark ones. Oh, chill. C12 by Revolution also. Okay. Just a little more in the Ashy Town area. I normally like the highlights to have a little like a tan. This is more um, ashy, but it's okay. Yeah. I'm gonna go ahead and attack underneath here though, because this area, if it dries out here completely, bye bye, adios. Oh, I like the highlight. I like how it leaves it, so there we go. Wow. back with the other booty blender here when you feel like you know see oh it brightened that forehead like high high five head and because the blend is so beautiful i'm gonna go ahead and attack the under eye like right away why not i'm glad that i didn't leave it longer because it does feel a little like tacky when you're blending so but the way is oh. hmm i'm gonna go down here underneath the contour and kind of clean up the line you know make it look snatch i'm gonna go in with um huda beauty this one's the color kufuna Kuf kunafa kunafa and this is just to set underneath my eyes not to highlight i legit just like cake it in there oh that's so nice so pretty um you guys we have to talk about it Yesterday, Nicki Minaj and Cardi B got into a fight. Well, Nicki was kind of hiding in the corner and Cardi was going for it and I love it. And I know it's not right because it's like two like women fighting. It's just stupid if you old, you have kids, whatever. But when you constantly have someone talking crap or saying stuff, when you for the hood, you're just gonna respond. That's just what happens, you know what I mean? Um, I do have to say I love both and this is so hard for me because I enjoy both of their music And now I feel like I have to choose and I don't want to choose You know, do you feel like you have to choose too? I don't want to choose. I like both like stop grow up You know be woman, but I don't want to be ratchet. I don't want to be like beat her ass <laughs> But that's not the right thing to do. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and grab YSL What is this called? So fit I can't pronounce that name but the YSL powder, and I'm gonna go ahead and set my face with it. Just a little bit of it so the face is set, you know, like, hi, how are you? Um, 
Now we're gonna move on to eyeshadow. Gonna be using Kylie's uh, first. This one right here is the bronze palette. I stole it from Ray. I still have to give it back to her. It's not mine. She told me, she's like, are you gonna bring my Kylie palette? I'm like, yeah. <laughs> um, but yeah, it's a really, really pretty palette. I'm gonna go ahead and be using all the brown colors, the transitions, the, all that to just get in there because the look that I'm going for is more focused here in the inner. I'm gonna start with this color right here, okay? This three, one, two, three. This three is the ones that I wanna use. Um, someone commented in one of my uh, videos the other day, like, you suck at eyeshadow, you're not like the other things. The thing is that I don't know how to draw like clouds and stuff like that in my um, eyes, you know? And if I put my work to it, I think I will learn, but I'm not, I don't want to. That's not the way I do makeup. So if you like those kind of eyeshadows and creative stuff, I'm not one of them. Sorry, I was gonna say something stupid, but I'm like, I'm just not one of those. I like a natural eye, beautiful, like, you know? Um, but there's so many amazing, talented artists out there that I bet you if you type it in YouTube, you creative eye look or whatever, you will find it. I'm um, like my friend Ryan, he's amazing with that creative stuff. Like what he creates, I'd be like, how the fuck, how you do that? How? I'm not one of them. I am so sorry. So if that's what you want from me, you're in the wrong channel, honey. You're in the wrong channel. Okay, so I'm using that little orange. I'm going with the same color and putting it all over the eye. Okay, then I'm going to go ahead and grab this color right here. And I'm going to keep this one more in the outer with the same brush right here. Ooh. I would never get dyed browns. They're just so pretty on the eye. I'm going in with a little more of the other brown, the dozen right here. Okay, like that. Then grabbing a clean branding, blending brush. I'm gonna go on top and blend out whatever is in there for those harsh lines or whatever. The same thing to the bottom. I'm gonna grab the this two right here. I'm not gonna grab the one that I used first. My lip, this one first, and then that one. And I'm gonna put this on the bottom right here. Yes, yes, honey, just, just bronzy eye. I can never get tired of it. Okay, so now we have the base already. I'm gonna have, be using one of the new ColourPop Jelly Much. This right here. I don't know. Yeah. it's basically jelly for your eye i don't know if you're supposed to use it with a brush i didn't read instructions i normally never read instructions before i do stuff but it's basically like a jelly and it's a shadow but look how beautiful that is can you see can i focus 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 focus, focus? there it is you see that so i'm gonna go ahead and grab a little bit of <laughs> where is that okay yeah, i need a flat brush i'm gonna go ahead and grab a little bit of that and go in my I'm scared. I'm stepping out of my comfort zone. I'm scared. Hold on, hold on, hold on. <laughs> okay, so it doesn't mirror. Flat brush, here we go. Ooh, okay. Oh, wow, this is kind of like, hi, how are you? Okay, so what I'm gonna do right now, that is so freaking pretty. Okay, what I'm gonna do right now, I'm gonna look up to see where my lid goes because, you know, you look up and you destroy your whole makeup. See that? I'm marking my lid. So this is where I'm going. I'm going all the way up here and not being scared. Because, you know, if you do it a little and then I don't know where you close your eye and then it's up top and it messes the whole look, so just let it mark it now and go on top of it. Like, <laughs> I beat you to it, honey, you know? Have the new pomograph eyeshadow palette. This right here is like luxury in a bit. Like you open this and you like expensive, expensive, expensive. Um, the colors, my okay. I'm gonna keep it hundred with you guys. Like this one's right here. I feel like I already have, but you can make it look whatever. But like, I let me put this on top of my jelly. Hold on, we're gonna put this on right here. This, 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 this. It looks like nothing, right? Swatch your finger on that. Look it. Look at that. Oh, wait. <sighs> Let me blow before I put it on because I don't want any drop off. But you're going to see 
Hold on. It's a lot of scratch you're falling. You guys, you see that? <laughs> Let's make it to another level. Let's take it to another level. Okay, wait. This is so freaking pretty. I'm like shaking my finger like this. <laughs> You're gonna get drop on your face. I hate that so much. But it's just like, I didn't want to do my eyes first. Oh man, I have glitter all over. That's amazing. Okay. Should I wet the brush? Ooh, look at that. Wait a minute, hold on, hold on. Let me wet the brush a little, put a little Fix Plus in here. It comes with the Maron thingy. You can mix it with this, but I just don't want to open it. I'm lazy, so I ain't going to do all that. I need a brush. Should we do a flat brush? Okay, we're going to wet you before we dip in there, see what happens. Shake, shake, just in case. Oh, that's so pretty. Oh my gosh. So I recommend to apply it with your fingers if you do your foundation afterwards because you're going to get drop, drop out, whatever you call it, fallout. A lot of fallout because it's glitter. But it's so beautiful. Oh my goodness. Look how pretty that is. Oh, I have, I just blew my ears out of Sorry. I had a glitter inside and I blow it and my boogers came out. Ooh, I love it. Look at that eye. Oh my gosh, I'm so proud of me. Talking about the eyeshadow cue. I know someone's going to come for me. No, you don't do that cute eyeshadow. Whatever. Okay? Whatever. Um, oh my goodness, I'm in luck. I'm going to go ahead and um, grab a little of this brown right here from the palette and go on top on the corner. Just a little bit of it, not too much. Oh my gosh, my eyes look gorgeous. Oh, there's a lot of wrinkling happening underneath my eye. A lot of wrinkling. A lot of wrinkling. So the concealer is good, but the wrinkle underneath my eyes. Oh, see, not everything will be perfect all the time. Right? I'm gonna go have grab a lot of Mercier. So I'm doing the same thing that I did with the Huda. I'm just setting it in there just to brighten. That's it. And yeah, I have a lot of follow-ups on my face. So I recommend to do the eyeshadow before your foundation because then you're going to have follow -up. But this concealer is crazy like no other. I stick to my other ones. Yes, I do. All right, so we're going to leave the eyeshadow like that. I'm going to move on to bronzer. I'm going to be using MAC Deep Dark. You guys already know what's up. What's popping? This right here, it's my jam, jam, number one, number one. And I'm going to go ahead and give my face some cheese. Some cheese in there. Some cheese. 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 Mm -hmm. Browns up, then I'm gonna grab a little bit of Sun Power, my jam too, and go on top of that. And I think, you know what, I'm gonna use this as a blush. Yeah. Because I don't think I brought another blush. No, you can use that as a blush, it's fine. And this is just to make it a little more redder around the face, to like warm me up, you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh, okay, so we're back with my eyebrows. Don't judge me on my eyebrows. I haven't seen gone. I haven't gone to see my eyebrow lady, so my eyebrows are kind of like, you know. Um. So yeah, we just did like whatever. I'm gonna go ahead and put mascara. Uh, grabbing my Tarte Light Lashes Camera. Go ahead and kick those babies up. Well, not kick. Just apply. I don't know why I say cake up for everything because, you know what? I'm trying to be looking cake up. The lashes we're gonna be using today. This ones are called Rad Vibe Cosmetics, and this one are called Roller Girls. And look at these lashes. Oh my god, I'm excited to put this on my eye. These lashes are still drying, but they look so pretty. I'm still gonna lift them up with this. I'm just waiting for it to dry because if I try to clump them right now, the whole lash is gonna come out with this. I'm like, let's wait a little minute. I'm gonna grab the color pop, keep me again, the jelly situation, and I'm gonna apply that in the inner corner. Ooh, this little keep me. This is cute. I was gonna play a little more of the pomegranate eyeshadow on the bottom, but I didn't because um, it has a lot of follow because it's glitter. So I recommend if you're doing this kind of look to do the eyes first and do foundation after because the eye. Oh my eyes are like, oh my god, it's so cute. But there's a lot of follow. A lot of, a lot of, a lot of, a lot of follow. 
ahead and grab a Wet n Wild black eyeliner. I normally use my feeling by Mac, but I don't have no idea where it is. And this is what it is. This is making it happen right now, and it works the same. So I feel like I'm missing a little more of the brown on the bottom. I'm gonna attack that bottom with the Kylie one. Oh, let's. See. And I guess that I'm bringing it down so much because the under eye, my under eye right now is cracking like the freaking pulling it out. I'm trying to fix it. I'm trying to fix it. From far away, it looks cute. So I think we're good. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and grab this little gem. I love this. This is when you feel like your lashes are too heavy or whatever. You go ahead and clink this together and it makes those lashes look bond and just, you know. Yeah, difference. Well, see, though, what are you doing? I'm gonna be using today's like pomegranate. I just I've been in love with. I broke my needle. What? I'm sad. I'm gonna be using the new eye highlighters for pomegranate. Also, I love this gold one. My middle one ripped, and I'm sad. But life goes on, and I'm just gonna leave it there and use it like that. You know. I'm gonna apply a little bit of this gold one in here. And because the eyes are so popping, I don't want to put too much highlight on. Well, that's why I say now when I'm applying it. And after like 20 strokes later, I'm like, oh. hello, hi, B. Mmm, <laughs> mm, mm, mm. Woo! Woo! Okay, Pompa, you got me over here feeling myself. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Um, yeah. So now we're going to move it on to lips. I'm going to be using cork. Of course, cork. It's my best friend for life. Um, we're going to go ahead and line. Mm, 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 mm. Then I'm going to go ahead and grab Anastasia lipstick. This one is in the color peachy matte lipsticks. Matte lips. Matte lipstick. I don't know why I call it matte. It's matte. Can I it up? That's cute. This peachy? Oh, this is going to be like my everyday when I do my new... I love that. I was going through my makeup and I was like, this is cute. Oh, that's... Lovely tut. Then I'm going to go ahead and grab another pomegranate item. This one is the Flesh Extra Lust Lip Gloss. And it's more like a nudie, peachy situation. And I'm going to apply this on top. Oh, that's so pretty. Oh my gosh. New lip concussion alert. Okay, B U K L. Oh, this is beautiful. Oh my gosh. I am living right now. Oh. And then because I just wanted to give it a try to see how it works, I'm gonna be using the Fenty new diamond milk and I'm gonna pop it in the middle. Mmm. 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 Let me put a wig on and I'll be back. Oh, wait, I can't forget. Fix plus, fix plus. Oh, yes, honey. I'm gonna put a wig on and I'll be right back. <laughs> All right, guys, so we are finished with today's tutorial. I hope you guys enjoy it. I enjoy making it. It's crazy how this whole truth and all this whole mess that is going on YouTube, it made me miss tutorials and it made me want to get back to it. Just showing you guys, having fun with them, putting making on with you guys, like, you know, just me and you, like, you know, chatty, chatty kind of thing and how we took it for granted. And now I see it because every time I go on YouTube, it's all about, you know, whatever situation. And I'm like, here we go again. Can we have tutorial? So I'm giving it to you guys. You know, I'm not going to stick with that. I'm not going to go in with the drama and the whole situation. I feel like it's pointless. And I'm in a point in my life right now that I'm very happy. And I want, I am peaceful. I don't want none of that negativity in my life. Go away, honey. Uh-uh. I don't need to know that. So I'm trying to stay here with you guys. Hopefully you guys are in the same route with me. Um, But anyways, I hope you guys enjoy this tutorial. I'm not going to lie. I was a little shocked because I was like, <laughs> I'm joking. When I finished my makeup, I was like, did this really come out of your hand? Like, you don't do this, you know? And I freaking love it. One thing I didn't like, though, is the concealer, the Revolution Concealer. It blended out beautifully, like you guys saw in the tutorial. But it's so much creasing underneath my eyes that I'm keeping you guys away so you guys don't see. I'm keeping you guys guarded, you know? Because this mess underneath my eyes is not cute. But other than that, I freaking, I love, I love this eye situation. And this new lip concussion, 
give it to me. What do you guys think? What do you guys think? Comment below and let me know. Don't forget to turn your notifications bell, clink, 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 to let you know when I upload because YouTube be playing everybody and it is what it is. So yeah, thank you for watching. And if you haven't subscribed, what are you waiting for to be part of the crazy familia? And I will see you guys on the next video. Ciao. Besitos.